program you're about to watch is powered by Eminent Digital Productions, NTV, Jumbo Limited, and Salad Master. Have you always wanted to prepare an African dish but never had the courage to try? Ngozi's Kitchen will put you at ease and equip you with skills to make various African dishes in a quick, easy, and healthy way. Whether you're an African or non-African, but passionate about quality African food, this program is for you. Tune in every Saturday, 4 p.m. on Sky Channel 184, Ben TV. Have you heard about the Wonder Salad Master? Salad Master is a health and nutrition cookware that helps you enjoy a healthier lifestyle. Guarantees better look, eliminates fat and oil, and maximizes nutrition in our food. Salad Master cookware is made from 3160i titanium surgical steel, the highest grade of steel. It returns on average 93% of nutrition in meals, thereby boosting your immune system and fighting lifestyle diseases like high blood pressure, cancer, diabetes, amongst others. With some Salad Master Cookware, you can fry your meat without oil, cook vegetable without water, defat and distart your food for maximum weight loss. Can you put a price on your health? Hurry now, Salad Master now available at your doorsteps. Welcome to the first edition of Ngozi's Kitchen. Today's mouth watery dish is going to be a delicious African dish, highly rich in protein, a traditional soup from Nigeria, and one of our beloved and most popular amongst Nigerians. Egusi comes from a specific type of melon grown in West Africa. It's served with pounded yam, gari, or fufu to help bring body and soul together. Today, Egusi has traveled to different parts of the world. I'm getting hungry now, let's get started. First of all, let's welcome my guest, Akuna, all the way from Essex. Thank Hello. You. Thank you. How are you? I'm good, thank You're you. Looking good? Thanks, yeah. Okay. Mm. So what category will I place you in um, cooking? Well, with... I am the busy mom that comes back from work and just want to cook something nice, mm -hmm. quick and healthy. Well, you're in the right place because um, Ngozi's Kitchen is, is going to prepare a meal today. Mm. It will see soup, very quick very easy and in a very healthy way. Good. Hello and welcome to Ngozi's Kitchen. Today's mouth watery dish is a nutritious and highly rich in protein and vitamin A and it's called Aki and Saltfish, an international dish from Jamaica popular in the western countries and wherever there are large communities of Jamaicans. Aki comes from a specific type of tree originated from West Africa. The outer part of the fruit starts off as yellowish green and turns red as it ripes. And when it's fully ripe, it breaks open naturally while on the tree. Aki and salt fish could be served for breakfast and dinner alongside boiled green bananas, plantain, yam, breadfruit and dumplings to help bring the body and soul together. Our guest today is Veneta from Salad Master. She will guide us in preparing Aki and salt fish in a quick, easy and healthy way. Veneta, you're welcome to Ngozi's Kitchen. Thank you for having me. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. All right. I'll get me the apron. Oh, wow. We're going to be cooking. So are you ready for the cooking today? I'm sure. Okay, that's for you. Okay. Put that on. So what do you do for a living? Can you fit that in? Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, my God. I'm trying to put it on. What I love is the this you've got on? Oh, you want to know? Yes, You really want to know? Yeah. Oh. Well, this yes. is what I call my African Caribbean mm -hmm. attire, otherwise known as Jamogerian. Jamogerian? Yes. Wow. So why, why Jamogerian? Oh, it's original. You've never heard it before? No, I never heard it before. How come you wouldn't <laughs> hear it? It is originally from me. I made that up because... I'm from Jamaica mm -hmm. originally, yes. and my husband is Nigerian, so right. and Jamogerian. Ah, you like Jamogerian. it? Jamogerian. You like wow, the name? Wow, that's a good uh, combination. Yes, Jamogerian. Yeah. So how did you get on with them um, cooking for this young gentleman that you got you into his kitchen? Oh, 
You mean my husband? Yes. Oh, God. He loves it. You know, they always say the way to a man's heart is through his stomach. Mm -hmm. Well, I just got him right there with, you know, my Caribbean mm. mixture with my African thing. Yeah. Just get it all together. Well, go, girl. <laughs> <laughs> now, can you guide us? Um, can you tell us what you've got here? Okay. The, the ingredients you've got. Well, as you there. said before earlier, mm -hmm. Ngozi, we're going to be cooking some lovely, juicy, sexy ackee and salt fish. Okay. Okay. Now, here, as you can see, can I just come across yeah, go here, on, you please? Go. Thank you. You're the, you're the chef today. So. <laughs> oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> right, here we've got our jumbo salt fish. Okay. But this is the one that we um, actually strip off the salt and all mm -hmm. that. How do you strip the, the, the okay, salt off? What I normally do is we normally wash it in, well, boil it in some hot water. Mm hmm for a while or we can soak it overnight okay and you just literally strip it take away as much bone as you possibly can from it all right okay okay but as i said to you because we're cooking a healthy nutritious meal mm -hmm. i've also got some fresh cod okay right so this one has got no seasoning no salt or anything to mm -hmm. it okay so this is the jumbo salt fish okay so that's how it comes yes, yes? this is how right. it's pre-packaged yeah mm -hmm. mm -hmm. okay Right, normally we use oil, mm -hmm. but as we're cooking a healthy meal, That's we're right. going to use a one calorie spray. So every time I do ch -ch, one calorie. I was going to say, Ningo's yeah. kitchen is quick, easy, and healthy. So that makes a difference. There you go. Yeah. Excellent. And here we've got some chopped onions. Yeah. Onions. Mm -hmm. I've mixed it with some purple onion. Okay. okay. Why did you do that? Is it well, just to change the color? Like, yeah, just coloring, really. Because okay. if you notice, everything here is all colorful, you know? Mm. Vibrant, just out to get <laughs> you like that. Yeah. And here we've got some lovely chopped tomatoes. tomatoes mm -hmm. Okay. And here we've got some spring onions mm -hmm. chopped. Right. But in Jamaica, we call it scallion. Scallion? Yes, yeah, scallion. Okay. I don't know right. why, but it's scallion. Spring onion, scallion. Mm. Yeah. And here we've got some lovely... Scotch bonnet pepper, smell it. Mm. 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 That's just a bit strong. Mm, yeah, lovely. But it's also mixed with some sweet pepper as well. Okay. okay, okay. Which we call the bell peppers. The bell pepper, yeah. Okay. Here we've got some black pepper. Mm -hmm. We're going to use it on the ackee and salt fish. All right. And here, because we're going to boil some plantain as well. So See. this is the plantain. All right. Okay. So it's all yours now. Yes. Let's get cracking. <laughs> from frying up the seasoning and all okay so first of all we can um because i'm using this one mm -hmm. which is the fresh cod all right we're gonna be frying it in one of these skillets okay, okay. i've preheated it before all right. so be careful it's very hot well yeah. we're using the salad master skillet because it's no it's salad master skillet actually instead of the burner we usually use yes. at home because of the healthiness in the yes using the cookware yeah so i know you tell us why you have to put it on well, you know, as you know, that Salad Master is a healthy nutrition company that we mm. help people to live a healthier lifestyle through the diet okay. by eliminating fat, grease, and oil from mm -hmm. the diet mm -hmm. and maximizing the nutrition in the food that we eat. Eat, okay. We also cut kitchen time in half and save people at least 50% of oh, the kitchen. Oh, tell me about it. Yeah. Kitchen, and you know time. <clears throat> oh, dear. Tell me about it. Do you know when the husbands come home from work? Mm -hmm. Oh, where is my dinner, honey? Yeah. You're going to be like... No, no, what to do? Yeah. Yeah, salad master is mm -hmm. in the way. <laughs> okay. Right, so here we've got, as I said to you, I've got the um the fresh the cod. cod. Mm -hmm. So we're going to um, fry it in here. But before okay. we do that, because cod is not naturally, it hasn't got any natural oil to it. Mm -hmm. So we're going to be using the one cal spray. Okay, just to... Just before you go there, yeah. you've missed out something. Oh, have I? Yeah. Okay. I think um, I'm going to show you... Two ingredients right. that you did not mention out of all. Okay. One, the first one is the fish powder. Oh. Jumbo fish powder. Right. This fish powder contains a well, is made out of actual fish extracts. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I've also have this one, which is jumbo all purpose seasoning. Right. Which contains garlic, oh. thyme. And African pepper. Wow. When you 
add these two ingredients into your dish. Mm -hmm. Yeah? First time, cook it with love, you will never go back. Wow. That yeah. sounds great to me. So we're going to use this to make this dish. Try it first time and then tell me what you think. Okay, of All course, right. with the lovely salad master That's cookware. Right. <laughs> lovely combination, isn't it? Why not? Wow. <laughs> Wow. Okay, so that's the first. Yeah. Why are you going to use the? Why are you going to start from that? Right. It's it, basically you could start with anything really. Okay. You know, <laughs> the thing about akin saltfish, there's mm. no right or wrong way to cook it. Okay. Right. But because, as I said to you, it's um fresh cod. Mm -hmm. it, you know, I'm. You know, I will be frying it. You know, pre-frying. You know, just like slightly pre-cooking it, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so that it could be soft and flaky. Okay. So yeah. we start off on this. So one. we start off with this Go one. On. So we're just gonna use, bang it in. Yes, and as I said to you, because I'm using cod ha hasn't got its natural oil in it, so we okay. have to use a bit of um, oil yes. base, okay. which is one calorie spray. All right. Okay. So this is basically what we do. Just spray it in. So are you trying to say that they should viewers should not go out buying granite oil, olive oil to do this? Absolutely not. I'm okay. not saying that. All I'm saying is if you want to eat Akin saltfish in a mm. nice, healthy, nutritious way, okay. this is the way forward, All you right. know. Right. I mean, Akin saltfish, we always lace it with um, oil. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But, you know, for people with diabetes and all that, you know, they don't really need oil. oil. All right. So the best thing to do is please, thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm just going to spray a bit of um, oil in the stove, right? Okay. Right. Okay. Can I have the cover? You please? want the cover yes. right now? Right, I'm not going to close it because if I close it like this, I'm going to be cooking, cooking. it. But I'm not cooking it, I'm just so literally fr frying it. Frying, okay. okay. Right. right, so here in this cookware, I'm also going to fry my ingredients. Mm -hmm. And my mom always say to me that onion, when you fry onion, mm. it brings out the aroma, <laughs> the sweet smelling taste of it. Okay. Okay. And also, I think, give putting this in there, is it, is it, why do you want to start off with the onion? The onion is just to give the aroma flavor to the What to about the, food. the spring onion? I can use anything. Okay. I can do maybe we should change it around now. Yeah, should we? Yeah, let's okay, great. <laughs> We do anything yeah. really, we just That's throw it in a pan like okay. that, yeah? There's no right or wrong way to okay. do it, yeah? Mmm, can you smell that? Mm. Can you smell mm. it? Mm. it? Smells good, isn't it? You know, so, you know, as I, I said, I, I love um, spring onion because it brings out, you know, that, that flavor. That aroma flavor, mm. yeah? We just throw it in here like that. Okay. There's no right or wrong thing for it. It's literally a very easy food preparation method, you know. Mm -hmm. you just leave it like that. Okay. What Maybe goes in just, next? Uh, you know, just make it just slightly brown. Mmm. Mm. Smelling good already. <laughs> <laughs> so for all those ladies, you mm -hmm. know, marrying to your African culture. I was know? going to say that to you, so that you know? when you, you, when you got married and you, you know, went to the Nigerian family, was it a problem to dish out the meal? Not African, at all. The African meal? Not at all, because no. all I did was, wait, was, mm. all I did was to bring in my flavor, my okay. taste, right. into the African culture, mm. and mm. it works wonders. Can you okay, just turn that over for me, please? Yeah. See? Mm. It's cooking. You want to put some more mist on it? No, it's just fine, just the way it is. Okay. Mm. Absolutely fantastic. Yeah, so what, what African food can you cook? Oh, me? Mm. <laughs> you know, every Sunday, right, yeah. is pounded yam day. Pounded okay. yam day? Yeah, pounded mm. yam day. <laughs> with what so, soup? Oh, you always have um, stew with... Um, a goosey soup. A goosey soup. Mm -hmm. Okay. He okay. loves that, absolutely. <laughs> That's quite healthy, you know. It is. Mm. I know. It's quite healthy. Yeah. Mm. Look at the colour coming together already. Mm. Oh, lovely. Mm. Love that. That colour is very rich. It's very mm. rich and different colours coming mm. together, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah, we're just going to add this to it. Do you want to turn down the tomato. heat a little bit? No, no, because yeah. we're frying, so okay. you fry it at high temperature. 
Right, one thing I didn't show you, the main ingredients. Okay. Can you believe it? It's what is ackee. that? Can you open it up? Open it! Open it up! <laughs> wow! It's a lovely aki. Now, this aki yes. is the one that we grow on the tree back home. Mm -hmm. But we can't get it here as fresh as, you know. So, so are you, uh, it's, if it's canned, this one is canned, yes, yeah? Yes, this one is canned. So normally, you in, in, in Jamaica... In, yeah, we just go outside, pick it from the tree. tree. Open it, take off the black head, uh -huh. clean out the inside, and right. put it on the cooker with some water mm -hmm. and salt, boil it, mm. and that's it. Okay. Oh, that one is going. Yeah. Need some mist so in it, this one. Spray some, because this fish mm. is very dry, mm. so you definitely need the. Um... Mm. <laughs> he smell that. Mm. Lovely, isn't it? Okay. Right. So, mm. <laughs> it's really nice. I'm, I'm feeling hungry. I know. Now, tell me, in, in Jamaica, is this sort of like a street food? Everybody can grab, like we can grab other foods on the streets from to the, be honest the with restaurants you, and no, things like that. This is a food that is sold normally in restaurants in Jamaica. Mm. And, you know, in the morning time, you know, men, they like to be fit and strong, you know, mm. to go to work. Mm -hmm. So they would normally have this with some boiled dumpling or right. some breadfruit, you know, roasted on the okay. open flame. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. <laughs> now, yeah. is, does it, is it, this meal, this dish, is it quite filling? Like it's having it in the morning? Yes. And then... Very filling. Would you be able to have your lunch if you have that? The thing is, with, because you're having banana, and banana is quite filling as well. Mm -hmm. With dumpling, it has carbohydrates. So okay. with all the protein and nutrients that is coming out of the ackee, mm. you know, and eating some fish. So it's really a balanced diet because this is really vegetable, mm. really. Mm. And you have your fish mm -hmm. that you get your omega-3 from and all that. And all right. You've got your aki where you get all the vitamins and protein mm. from and all that. that, so that's quite... The pepper is coming out. It's, you can smell mm. it, can't you? smell it. Yeah? Yeah. Right, so this one okay. should be ready now. Mmm. Yeah. Look at that. Mmm. Mm. That so smells all we delicious. Do is just add that add to it. Add it to it, yeah. Switch this off. Yeah. I'm going to add some. Right. Okay. So we're going to add some of this one to it as well. All right. Okay. Just enough. Now you don't have to add anything too much to it. That's all it is. I know you're coming. You're My telling me about your super ingredients. Super ingredients. Okay. No problem. So add it with love. With love add it with love. love yeah. With love, as love. you know, because it's salad master, we try not to use too much seasoning. So I'm okay. just going to use just a small portion of your seasoning. Add this in there. Okay. Yeah. Add, add it so in. <laughs> Come Great. on. Great, all I right. A spoon in oh, there there's already. a spoon there already. Mm. Right. Mm, it smells quite nice actually. Mm. I like it. Yeah, we, wow. you haven't actually I haven't you haven't got garlic. No, I did a purpose. So with the garlic in, I'm sure it will give it the right yeah. aroma and the flavour we need. Wow. Okay. Mm -hmm. Try that one for now. Okay. And right. Yeah, what what the, is this one? The fish stock. The fish uh, stock or oh. the fish powder. Okay. Mm -hmm. Right. Right. That's right. So you're saying that with my ackee and saltfish now, ah, with this new jumbo I'm, I, taste. I'm telling you, with your ackee and saltfish, with the jumbo, uh, gives uh, it the right flavor. Yeah, the right with the mix, jumbo right? ingredients inside, you have no problem. Wow. So you know your guests it? will sit asking for more. Wow. Your husband would come for more. <laughs> your loved ones out there will come for more. Wow. It's all about what you put in. In your Aki. Do you know what? I agree secret. with you 110%. Yeah. That's right. Because you know? right. as I said to you, my mom always said, just make sure you prepare your husband dinner. Mm -hmm. He'll be happy mm -hmm. with you. Well, the you secret know? in cooking is not just cooking, it's using the right ingredients. Yes, and of course, using the right cookware, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Okay. I'm, so, I'm so much having fun here. So in goes the Aki now. Right, so this is the Aki. Okay. So all I'm going to do so is. What it came in a can, and yes. is it in brim or is it in water? Yeah, sometimes it comes in brim, okay. and sometimes it comes in just pure, pure mm. water. Mm. The brim, it, they normally add a bit of salt to it, mm -hmm. you mm -hmm. know, so... I tell you what, it looks like um, scrambled egg. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Like scrambled egg. But the difference is it don't taste the same. <laughs> well, when we taste it, they, well, they will see. taste it, we'll find out. Yeah, yeah. let's see. All right. Okay. So there we go. 
Mm, that looks nice. Wow. Very colorful. Very colorful. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Can you smell it? Yeah. Mm, I can't wait to taste this. Mm. Wow. Oh dear. Breathtaking. Breathtaking. So all <laughs> I'm gonna do now is just to add some more black pepper to it. Okay. We Jamaicans we love our black pepper, mm -hmm. especially on Akin sauce. Well, adding this black pepper, is it what? Is, why, why do you add it? Why For some reason, it? it's just generation that always use it. I mm -hmm. haven't got no idea why they even mm -hmm. do it. But I believe that it's just to give it a bit more coloring to okay. it. Okay. Okay. Because if you notice on the color, mm. you know when you sprinkle the black pepper on it, it gives it a bit of um, color. Right. In addition to what is already there, can mm -hmm. you see that? Mm -hmm. Can mm -hmm. you see? Mm. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you don't add water. You don't no, add nothing. nothing. No. Okay. Absolutely right. nothing. So all I'm gonna do is now cover it. Cover it up. Okay. And then I'm just gonna turn it down to 85 degrees. Okay. Let's, okay. Cover, let's cover this one. We're not using this anymore. No, we're finished with that one. Okay. And we're just gonna just put it on for another five more minutes and okay. that's ready. Right, so what are we going to serve the Aki with? Ooh, I'm glad you asked that. <laughs> yeah. Well, what I've done earlier on was mm -hmm. to cook some dumpling. Okay. With some planting. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it's over there, but we'll look at that in a second. Okay, but if, if, if you're not going, if I don't have plantain and I don't have dumpling, what do I do? We, we normally use green banana. Green banana? Yeah, not ripe banana, green okay. banana. Right. You can get it at the local shops. Okay. You know, literally when the banana is just picked from the tree before mm. you start putting it to ripe and all mm. that. Mm. You just mm. put the green, literally green banana, you just buy it, put it in some water because it, it can stay, Stink. yeah. A lot of people run away mm, from that, mm. but if you put it, the banana, slice it in the water, and then peel it in the water, then in the fingers, water, yeah, in the okay. water. So warm you know, or, or cold? It just Look bearable, warm. yeah. Okay. All and right. you just put it in some hot water to boil. Mm. But you know, in the salad master, you can just literally put it inside the um, pan without any water, okay. and it will actually boil. All right. Yeah. Okay. That's the so. What about the bread salad fruits? master? The breadfruit. No. I've had Usually in my household, right? Mm. We. We must eat breadfruit every summer, right? Right. So almost every weekend we'd have a barbecue. Okay. okay. Barbecue with yeah. breadfruit? Yeah. Oh yes. I tell you, it's the sweetest breadfruit ever. Yeah. All you do is get the green breadfruit. Mm. You make sure my mom normally do that. Okay. To make sure it's soft. Pop. No, make sure it's proper ripe. Oh. Not okay. ripe, but fit enough to be cooked. All right. Right. Okay. Okay. So what we normally do is flame up the barbecue, you know, because it's in England, this mm. is England, but mm. normally in Jamaica, mm. we just have open flame and we'd put the um, breadfruit on mm -hmm. it to mm -hmm. actually just roast it. Yeah. So outside we get dark and we normally get a, a fork or a knife and yeah. stick it in the heart because yeah. the breadfruit has a heart. Mm. Mm. Stick it inside and if anything comes out, then we know that, you know, it's cooked. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Then you roast it. That's roasted. Mm. On Always the flame. Roasted. Yeah, it's roasting on the flame. Mm. Open flame. Okay. So when we think around it is So it has to enough. be soft. Yes, inside when it's inside. cooked. Mm. Soft, it's more like cooked. Okay. So it gets okay. yellow. Okay. Let's see yeah. what the plantain and the dumpling can do. Okay. <laughs> right. Okay, this is the you want me to bring it over there? Yeah. Okay. So tell us what you've got in there. Right. So this is um, my dumpling okay. and my planting. Hold on. I can put it here. Okay. So this is dumpling and planting. The dumpling is made from um, flour, plain flour. Okay. So all I did earlier was to make a paste with it. Okay. With water. Okay. And then knead it, you know, like do mm -hmm. that. Well, it's lovely, mm. you know. <laughs> you need your, you know, your soul into it and your heart. Oh, into it. yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's basically what I yeah. do. And then uh, kind of make it into a dough, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. And I just make it with, you know, circular shape. Mm. Put it in the hot water. And okay, did you add you know, salt or no, anything into no it? No salt whatsoever. No? Okay, no salt. so what do we do now? Now we've put it on the fire for harm. And it's ready to... It's ready to... It's ready, to, literally, in 10 minutes. 10, 15 minutes, the dumpling is ready. Okay. Yes. Okay, so it's time to serve Yes, this. I'm sure it's... If fit. this is ready. Yes, this is okay. let's, super ready. Let's open it and let's you see sure what's you going on see it? Are you sure you want to see it? Are you sure you want to see it? Okay, now, when I open it, oh, I yes. want you to first look at two things, okay? Mm -hmm. I want you to look at the colour. Yes. And I also want you to take a sip. Okay. 
smell right. it and see if you can smell anything, mm -hmm. all right? Mm -hmm. okay. Well, it, uh, like they say, the, 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 what, how does it go? What, the proverb? The, no, 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 not the proverb. He says, like, the, the, the taste is in the, the the cooking, oh, there's a way to say it, the, 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 the pudding, something in the pudding. The, cook, the taste is in the cooking. No, we are getting it wrong. The the uh -huh. There's a way to say the taste in the pudding is by eating, eating it. it. Right. So let's see what you've got in there and let's see how oh, it goes. Come brilliant. on. Okay, so Come on, I'm waiting. Said, yeah? mm, are you ready? I'm waiting, sure? yeah. Should we do a jump, right? <laughs> <laughs> Come on. All right. Wow. Mm. Did you smell that? Mmm, absolutely delicious. delicious. You see? Yeah. You see that little oil that spray into it? Did you see that? Oh, let me let me have that. Oh, thank you very delicious. much. Delicious. It looks very, very colourful. Oh yummy that is. Mmm. Mmm. And the good thing about it, did you notice we just chuck everything in? We, in didn't, and we didn't have to put anything, you know, like measuring mm, and everything. Mm, you know. Mm. And it's very nutritious. It is very nutritious. Very nutritious. It's packed with vitamins the children and can eat this. Yes? Oh yeah, they absolutely. Everybody can eat it. Yeah. All right. Absolutely. So okay. should we share some? So let's um, share some. some of this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. You have a, Let me get a plate. Yes, please. All right. That's the plate. Thank you very much. You can hold this one. Let's just move this away. No okay. problem. Yummy. Mmm. Delicious. Mmm. Mmm. Gorgeous. Okay. So here is our lovely dumpling. Okay. See? Right. And our planting, we just cook in the skin. We mm -hmm. just easily roll off like that. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. Very nice. Fantastic. Yes. <laughs> Whoa. Go. That's your dinner this or your breakfast served. My breakfast. Yes. I call this breakfast? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's my dinner. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Now, let's, let's, let's dig in. Let's Ooh. clear this and uh, check, check it out. Yeah. Okay, let's just put this aside. Okay. Do you want to move this a little bit? Should we just cover this Okay. It's time to taste this gorgeous, mm. sexy, yummy, exotic. I'm going for the dumpling. You see dumpling me? First. Okay. Mm. Mm. How is it? Very rich. Yeah. The flavor. Can you taste anything in particular out of it? The jumbo. Yeah. Fish powder. Mm -hmm. The jumbo. Did you taste it? Mm. Can taste it. The all-purpose seasoning, yeah. The flavor, the taste, the aroma is absolutely it's all in there. Gorgeous. Now, the dumpling. Wow. I'll go with both of them. Mmm. 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 Very, very good. Now, that's what I call good cooking. Mmm. Mm. So this is what you're. Everybody in Jamaica has been enjoying. Well, yeah. <laughs> actually, this is our national dish. Akian mm. saltfish is mm. our national, it's dish. national dish. Yes, it's, an, it's our national dish, and we eat it. It's lovely. I mean, Jamaicans on the whole eat this it's at lovely. least once or twice a week. Mm. Mm -hmm. Before you go, I'm going to invite some of the experts to come and test this lovely dish you've made here. Okay, great. Okay? I'm going to invite our guest, Kola and Tony. Kola, can you please come forward? And Tony, please come forward. Okay, this is a. I'm gonna clear this off. Just tell us what you think. Okay. Um, put that one over there. That's for you. That's for you. Okay. Yeah, tuck in, tuck in, tuck in, yeah, enjoy tuck. it. How long no. did it take to cook this? <sighs> Ten minutes. Looks very nice. Well, well presented. Is it? Test, test it first and tell us what you think. Mm, oh, that's really nice. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. Mm -hmm. The best way to 
to eat the specific dish is to take a bit of the um, dumpling, dumpling mm-hmm. put a bit of the Akin sour fish. Yeah. Together like yep, that's Just, right. That's right. I'm learning so much. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much for coming. Thank you for coming, Vanessa. Thank you very much for having me on your show. I really welcome. enjoyed it. You're welcome. Thank you. Lovely dish you've got yeah. there. Thank you. If you've never cooked an Afro-Caribbean dish before, this is your chance to roll up the sleeves and go for it. I hope you will have much fun cooking and eating, sharing with your loved ones to keep the unique taste of your food alive. Continue using Jumbo products. The secret in cooking is using the right ingredients. Also, when you are confused in the kitchen, go to Ngozi's Kitchen Way. It's quick, easy, and healthy. I'm sure you've learned something new today. So go rock your kitchen until next week. Carry on cooking. Guan cooking. Guan cooking. See you next week.